What's up Squat Squad and welcome to Slob Guns. So you're living behind enemy lines but then you go to Freedom Land, you go to a gun store and you see some really awesome guns out there and you start wondering, can I have it? Well, you find something like this. It's a nice Troy AR, but you can't have it. Why? Well, it has a flash hider, which is evil, and it has a collapsible stock because, you know, you're going to sneak it under your coat and apparently you're not going to be able to see it. You're blind. Can't have that. So then you look at this little pretty thing. Well, this is almost a one of a kind Robinson XCR gun. Well, you can't have this either. Why? Because, well, it has a pistol brace and it's a pistol. And if you live in some stupid states, well, it's way over the limit. So you can't have that. And then you see this guy. Well, who am I kidding? It's a machine gun. Of course, you can't have it. But did you realize that you can actually have this? Well, you ask, wait, wait, what's going on? You have the same flash hider. You have an evil pistol brace, and it's certainly over the limit. But alas, why is it legal? Because of one little thing of what it says right here. It's an other firearm. One of the reasons that it's legal and 100% approved by the New Jersey State Police is that this qualifies as per the ATF as an other firearm. What this means, it's not a pistol, it's not a rifle, and it's not a short-barreled rifle. And as such, based on today's laws and interpretations by the New Jersey State Police, you can legally own this. What it is, is simply the most fun you can have, legally, living behind enemy lines. So this guy is the Troy A4 Other Non-NFA Firearm. And it's going to be available from Tech Ops, Op Tech Ops International in Phillipsburg, New Jersey, or go down to your local dealer and you'll be able to request one directly from them. Let's talk about the major features on this gun. Let's start at the back. At the center of the other firearm is the SB Tactical Brace. Because it's an other firearm, it does not need to be pinned in place and it could be adjustable. One of the things I really like about it is that it is nice and sturdy. You do not have a lot of wiggle as you do with a lot of the guns. So this is actually really, really good. Uh, moving forward, you have a Troy Polymer AR grip. What's nice about it, it has really, really good texturing on the sides. A little bit flatter on the back, but it's actually pretty good. You can get a good grip on it. It's not going to slip that much. What I like about it, it's a little bit more upright than your typical AR grip. Um, so it's certainly nice. Uh, moving forward, you have your standard AR-15 lower. But once again, what makes this gun special is the fact that it has other firearm directly on there. A couple of the guns, they don't have it, it's just a regular AR lower receiver, but you can definitely feel safe on here that if you do get pulled over or get hassled at the range, you can just say, look, here's the other firearm, and you do have the New Jersey State Police letter that you can do. All right, so let's move forward. Um, you have this very nice rail. It looks like it's right around 10 inches long. What I like about it, so I mean, it is Troy rail, and if you have smaller hands, you're definitely going to appreciate that you're going to be able to get a good grip all around it, and it's going to also lighten up the mass on it. What's really cool is that you have M-lock all around, so you have it in seven positions, I believe. One, two, three on the bottom four, and then five, six, and seven. So if you want to put M-lock attachments anywhere, you can certainly do it. At the bottom, you have another central feature of the other firearm, which is going to be your vertical foregrip. 
Once again, to keep the legality on it, the guns need to be manufactured with the foregrip and this guy already comes with it. You can move it closer or further away depending on what you need it. But for me, this was actually perfect, especially if you have a forward grip on there. Of course, if you need to adjust the length of pull, simply move the pistol brace and you're gonna be in a good position. I certainly like this. It's gonna be really, really, really good. Um, once again, let me just turn this way. So the way I would actually shoot it, one, holding it here and thumbs forward with a thumb directly on here. All right, um, I guess let's move to the front and then work back. Um, you do have a Troy Medieval compensator. I'm sorry, it's a compensator slash flash hider. It is not a muzzle brake, but once again, you do not need to worry about it because it's an other firearm. So it doesn't matter if it's a, it doesn't matter if it's flash hider. All right, um, let's work backwards. So then we have the barrel, which is made, it's a 12 and a half inch barrel, and it is made by Roscoe, which are pretty good barrels. They've been coming into the market for a relatively newer manufacturer, but it's really, really good quality. And this guy is 4150 DCMV. What's nice about it is that, once again, it's 12 and a half, and then you do have the flash hider but the flash hider is not permanently attached. So then if you do go visit your friends in a free state, you can definitely throw on a suppressor on there or any other muzzle device. If you do want a brake or anything else like that, it's threaded half by 28. Um, the gas system on here is a Troy gas system. It is using a standard gas block and you do have a carbine gas system. One of the things that was really attractive about this, so I mean, it is a 12 and a half. It doesn't use pistol gas, so you do get a good carbine gas system on there. We've put about 100 rounds through the gun. At first, there was absolutely no issues with the ejection. There was definitely positive ejection. Uh, nice four o'clock pattern. Um, so the gun felt great, and the recoil on it was quite nice. And really cool part about it, short barrel makes a really, really nice loud bang. Uh, the gun does have a regular charging handle. You can swap it out if you want an oversized charging handle or anything else along those lines. And lastly, what makes this gun a little bit different is some of the competing products. They do not come with sights. Uh, what you do have with the Troy is it will come with the Troy folding battle sights. Uh, so they are backup in nature, but you can definitely use them. I mean, I was shooting them out here and they're pretty precise. Press the button and they fold down. You can put your optic on top and you can certainly co-witness them if you want to. So those are the major features of the gun.
I like it. Um, depending on where you're purchasing it, so if you do purchase it in a banned state, it does come with 10 round magazines and it'll run with any air yarn mags, be run mag poles, destroy mags, anything will go in there. Um, if you do live in Pennsylvania or anywhere else outside of that, you can use regular 30 round mags. Which leaves the question, it's certainly a great value proposition if you live in a state like Connecticut or New Jersey where this is, let's be honest, it's a loophole gun. But why would you want to purchase this gun if you're living everywhere else where you can't legally purchase an AR pistol? The reason why is fairly simple. If you have an AR pistol or any other pistol with a brace, you cannot put on a vertical foregrip. With this gun, the way it's designed as an other firearm, you can do it. So with pistols, you can put on angle foregrip or the thumb stops, but you can't put on a vertical foregrip. You can certainly do it with these guns. So that is the Troy A4 other firearm. I hope you enjoy the video and I'll catch you next time. Going really hot. Cheers. This is an AK-47, full automatic. Hi, baby. Well, can you hi, hold guys. on? Can you hold on? I just gotta dump this magazine. Hold on. That's it. That was quick. How many rounds did you put in there? That was like nothing. I think it was like 20. Hey, baby. Hi. Uh, I put my wife on hold so I can finish this magazine. That's so much fun as always. Hi, baby.